Two electric city organizations are teaming up, so more paramedics are on the streets of Great Falls. MTN's Margaret DeMarco has more on how the new program works. Uh, no. Anyone pass medical history? Beginning stages anyways of a six month medic program. Great Falls firefighter Adam Jordan has been attending class at Great Falls College MSU for the past two months. Uh, for us being able to do it in such a short amount of time, it's beneficial for the department. We gotta figure out how many grips a second. Emergency Medical Services Program Director Joel Henderson says Dr. Susan Wolf recognized the need for more paramedics in Great Falls. We talked about the possibility of doing a, uh, a paramedic um, cohort and over a kind of a shorter period of time. We did some research, we looked into a, what we call a paramedic academy style. The students have longer classes, meet more days of the weeks, and they are learning the same material as a traditional student. <laughs> the students must first be EMT certified before they start the program. The move to paramedic is, is a, a move to advance life support, ALS care. And so they can start IVs, they can get medications, they're trained in uh, ECGs. Firefighters are able to use knowledge they have already gained on the job for their classroom experience. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff that we've seen already, you know, in our careers um, that expedites this process uh, on the, the front end of it. What was this pressure from you? Soon these firefighters will be back on the job as paramedics. In Great Falls, Margaret DeMarco, MTN News.